let me show you completely free an open source tool that you can use and automate your browser. Uh, the, the tool is a nano browser. This is a GitHub page. And also, we are not going to use the GitHub page to make it simple. We are going to use the browser extension. Okay. Uh, the only thing that you need to go is just to go to the Chrome Web Store and just search for the Nano Browser. Okay. And this is the extension. And after you install it, it's going to show here. Okay. I already have it. I already installed and already configured my API. To automate any task, you need to define your uh, API key. Okay. It can be any model. In this case, I'm going to use Gemini because I have pro version, but you can use any model. Like you can need to create, go to the add the new provider, like a, just selecting Grog and put your API key, or you can just select, I don't know, DeepSeek or whatever you want, and then save. And it's going to use your API key to, to do the task. Okay. So we already have here. What I'm going to do is, okay, let me close all the page and show you something interesting. Okay. I'm going to ask Nano Browser to, okay, go to Twitter, search for WWDC25. This is Apple event, okay? Analyze top 20 tweets and create a thread for me. I will share on my Twitter account. So I don't have time to, to watch the, uh, this event, so I'm going to just relieve some tweets and I'm going to create a thread for that. Okay, let's see what's going to happen. As you can see now, it created a task, it just browse, browse the Twitter. So in this case, it uh, it definitely sh you should log in, otherwise it's not going to be able to search anything. So now you can see it searched for, for this keyword now it's looking for the tweets so it's going to analyze and then a create tweet for me almost completed so still doing some research scrolling down within tweets now you can see it's completed the research you know, and it gave me three threads that I can share on my Twitter account. As you can see here, I can just directly copy and paste on my Twitter account. All right, as you can see, it has completed the basic task, but you can use for complex task as well. Uh, you need to give a, a tailed prompt. As an example, you can ask this tool to like a create an account on X website and then go to the Gmail while date my account and then browse the application again and do some other task. Also, you can use this tool to find maybe a, a passport appointment, visa appointment, or you can use uh, uh, to find a product on Amazon website just by searching it and it's going to filter and you can ask to just filter by price, by top seller, and it's unlimited to use. It's completely free and safe, but I recommend you to uh, use on completely different browser because it's collecting every single data. It's just a, a heads up. Thank you so much.